Welcome back. This is your Feel Good Breakfast Show. Happy Thursday to you. Thanks for joining us at the start of a brand new day. I sound like I'm running my mouth off right now because we're talking about running. And of course, it's something that is very accessible as a form of exercise for most people out there. You don't even need a gym. Um, and Grant Hines is here in the studio this morning to share some of the most innovative, coolest running tech that you can invest in. Because as they say, summer bodies are made in winter, right? So get yours <laughs> now while stocks last. <laughs> well, I was really excited when lockdown level four hit and we could run. Right? right? Like, oh. I I, like, running is one of those things. It's just my meditation. It's yeah. just the, the, my happy space. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And yeah. Um, as a tech head, you know, I love Being my technology. To... There's a way to like kind of like bring it all together. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So uh, I've, I brought in a bunch of tech that I use uh -huh. like regularly, uh, which is really cool. Um, and I know that one thing that you were very excited about, it's, in fact, I was raving more about your hair because you got new hair. Oh, I do. Um, I do. <laughs> you do, which looks very cool. Uh, but the thing that you were raving about were running shoes. Like, that's, yes. like, that's like part of your new obsession, right? Yes. Yeah, so I've got, uh, actually, I'm actually wearing them now. So you oh, can yeah? see, they're, they're brighter than my hair right now. <laughs> <laughs> it's like topsy-turvy time. Just... But running shoes are becoming more about uh, what, what the data that is being collected. Look at this. Yeah. It's super, super bright. Okay. So these ones are called the hovers. And what... What they've got inside them is they've got a Bluetooth chip that measures your activity or running activity. Of course, the most obvious thing is that it measures the distance you travel. Yes. But a lot of that technology exists in other things that I'm going to be showing you today. Okay. Cool. One of the most important things that the hover does is that it measures your stance and your, remember, the, the cadence and the way you run. Remember, that is really important. If you have the wrong posture or the wrong form, yeah. you can injure yourself quite badly. Yeah, that's and true. And often with exercise, we, don't, we can't really afford like a personal trainer or or you can't necessarily afford somebody to come with you on every single run, you know, somebody that studied the stuff or was professional yeah, with the stuff. Yeah, yeah. So to have a device with you that's constantly monitoring your posture, like, like the hovers, wow. and give you that information and feedback will help you improve your posture so that you are fitter for longer, prevent injuries like that's knee injuries and back injuries. And then also just keep you running for longer, which is really wow, important. Wow, man, that's a so, lot of tech in a shoe. Right? So, so that's... Back to the future. So that's extremely, <laughs> that's extremely important. I, I don't go anywhere without my watch. So this yeah, is my, yeah. my active watch. And what, what happens is... Um, and it's constantly charged. <laughs> it's, it's constantly charged. Every single morning, I, like every, every night, I, I put it, I charge it. But one of the highlights of this particular device is that a lot of smart watches are coming out with uh, hard drives yeah. inside of them. So you can use your favorite music service and download music. Like you can, oh, yes, I have a running yes, playlist yes, yes. and then download that playlist directly to the device, yeah, yeah, right? Yeah. And then I use, uh, these are earbuds, um, you know, like buds that I use. Yeah, yeah. These are wireless. They use Bluetooth technology, yes, 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 yes. a lot of Bluetooth technology. And you can connect directly to, here's my espresso alarm to wake me up in the morning. <laughs> um, then I can use my, my watch to connect directly to my headphones yeah, yeah. and leave my cell phone at home or okay, leave it in the car. Okay. So you want to make, make sure that you are running as light as you can. That's true. And that, the, that you're not getting notifications. That's why I call it my meditation time. No one can get hold of me when I'm running. Ah, and then of course with that and uh, the connection with the, with the shoes, you're able to then get the distance and the mapping and the route because sometimes you like to have a favorite route that you run for yes, particular I, reasons and you want to remember what that route is. The one, yeah, you, you want to have, no, no, I, I, I remember the route, but the data that's been collected about that route, I want to see improvement, especially True. over a period of time. Yeah, 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 Not yeah. necessarily every single run, but over a period of time. And the more data I have on that, the better. So the watch is doing that. So to, to activate a run, I'm glad that you mentioned yeah, that. Yeah, yeah. You just, I literally just have it to, um, to set on the, on the right swipe over here. So uh -huh. I, swipe, I swipe right yeah. uh, on my watch. Uh, and, then it, and then there's running or cycling activities. or swimming. So there's a lot of different or activities. Or hiking or, yeah. You can add, yeah, you can add. But I obviously have run. There we go. It's ready. It, it, no, sorry, watch. I'm not running right now. <laughs> Thinks I'm running, but I'm not. to count you down. So why are you standing still? <laughs> um, so, and then you, when you finish your run, you can finish your workout and it will log it into yeah. uh, your health app on your, yeah. on your device. And some smart watches I know are, are kind of like um, in tune enough that if you start moving very differently from, let's say, a walking pace to walking faster, it can recognize that you are now doing that form of exercise and just immediately log it on for you automatically. It can. Cool. But I, I, like, I like to get as accurate Official. as possible. I like, da I like data, so I like to have it as accurate <laughs> as possible. All right, um, cool. So that's, the, the, that's probably one of my favorite things to run and why yeah. it makes my running feel like such a 
great thing. And also, it's running? safer to run without your device Absolutely. if you can. But not everybody can afford all of this technology. Some yeah. people have wired headphones, and I know a lot of people out there are going like, I'm not buying wireless headphones. Yeah. I get yeah. you. Yeah. I understand. So one of the things, the cheapest things you can get is a running belt. Mm -hmm. I didn't know about these until I did some hardcore research. They're made of like a neoprene or an elastic. Mm -hmm. um, it's not like quite high tech, but you can stretch it out and fit in a... Uh, uh, a, phone could fit a, in a phone could fit in here, but as you can see, look how high, like wide it stretches. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Um, and then I also, I've just put my phone in the other way around so that it's not by the zipper, mm -hmm. so it protects the screen. Yeah. And then you can zip this and then hide this quite comfortably underneath your clothes or as a as a as a belt underneath your running ah, stuff. Okay. And then you can just use your headphones and then obviously use the inline controller to do it. So this is a cheap way to be able to use the existing uh, your existing phone as a running device with music. And also, you want to keep your phone with you if you don't have another device that's measuring your distance or your posture because you want to have that data. And the phone is constantly uh, measuring with the accelerometer and the gyroscope. It's yeah. measuring how far you go and logging that stuff. If some medical health people encourage you to uh, to log that stuff so that you get points or whatever, there we go. and that's how you do it legitimately is with the phone yeah. Uh, yeah. to yeah. do that. So Wonderful that's stuff, man. Great way to do it. Wow. Okay, new ways of enjoying running out there. Our thanks to Grant, of course, as always. But of course, stay with us because we'll be reviewing one of the biggest games Games currently out, but for now, let's head on over to our fitness expert Ryle, who's showing Ute a thing or two about working those abs.